The Chinese have definitely got it right when it comes to spare ribs. I mean, who doesn't like spare ribs? You know, the chili, the garlic, the five spice, the ginger, you know, all that stuff together. I mean, it's such a such an intense dish. And Absolutely. So, so finger licking, that's what I like about it. So guys, I'm going to show you guys my version of the spare ribs. So let's get at it. Here we have some spare ribs which I've trimmed nicely for us, right? Over here as you can see. Right? These usually have a lot of fat on them, isn't it, Nika? Exactly. I've trimmed off the fat of that and what I've then, then done is I've, I've parboiled it, mm -hmm. like half, and I've got about half left. So I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to boil it. I'm going to put them into boiling water right here. Okay. Right? Put them in here right now, as you can see. Oops. See that? Okay. And the whole boiling process would take about an hour and a half. Mm -hmm. I've already boiled them for about 45 minutes to an hour. Right. I'm just going to do the last part over here, right? Finishing it off. Exactly. Now, you can put some of that in, you know what that is. Okay, so we have some cinnamon here. Cinnamon. Just cinnamon bark, so I'm right. just going to throw it in. Mmm. And the ginger. Absolutely. You know what that is? Four cloves of smashed garlic. Absolutely. Going in. I'm going to put a couple of cloves in there. Just a couple of cloves. Cloves See. are so strong, so a little goes a long way. One star anise is more than enough. It's really flavorful. Mmm, smell, yeah. Best spice for barbecuing. That goes in there. I got one onion chopped up there in, in dice, as you can see. Nice onion. I'm gonna throw that in. And uh, I've got some bay leaf there. Bay leaf? Yeah. A few of those in there. Mmm, nice flavor. Mmm. Some salt, my dear. Salt to taste. Lovely. Some sugar to give that little sweet touch. Nice. There you go. And some soy. I'm going to put a tablespoon of soy. So, so much about this dish is actually cooking the meat with these flavors instead of the sauce, yeah. isn't it? If you're really pressed for time. Throw in all that meat, all these herbs together into a pressure cooker. Uh, you know, a couple of minutes, maybe 10, 15 minutes later, you're ready with your spare ribs ready. And I'm, I mean, you're at least uh, three quarter done. And then you're going for the toss, which is the final kill. Mmm, they look done to me. Yum, they do look delicious. This is soft there. You can see how soft they are. So I'm going to take them out, Natasha. Okay. Can you give me that cola in the back? No problem. You mean the slotted spoon? Slotted spoon, yes. I got it. You got it? Uh, uh, yeah. There you go. Put them in here, Natasha. I'm moving so you don't splash on me. Let us get into the final kill. Okay. The barbecue spare rib, right? Some oil. I'm going to fry these up with some garlic and chili. Okay, we're going to throw some garlic here. As you can see, we have plenty of it. So, here we are. We have about 10, 12 cloves of garlic chopped up. Natasha likes a lot of garlic <laughs> because she likes to smell of it the whole day. It's great. I just love, uh, you know, her interaction. I think it's the opposite, Nikhil. <laughs>